Hey everyone, we're here again with Chef Nico for the November edition of Cooking with Nico. This month I've assigned him a collaboration beer between True Respite and District East. It's called Moonlight Manifesto and it's a robust rye porter. Hey Nico, what did you uh, whip up for us this time? So uh, this time um, I kept it simple in terms of making sure that this particular recipe could be used by everyone. Um, I went with um, a Moroccan rub and just and I think uh, by everyone he means me uh, yes. because I'm an Of course, so of he, course you, you are the first in down line. For me this time. <laughs> Um, you, you know, many of us tend to, when we get into the darker beers, uh, lean towards perhaps desserts, um, just simply due to the grain bill, um, the roasted malts, uh, you've got a little sugar forward, uh, more rounded mouthfeel, um, and there's some sweetness, of course, uh, with some of these darker beers. Um, however, this particular beer, the Robust Rye, um, in tasting it, uh, su super delicious, first of all, guys, great job. Um, I felt a really nice roasted meat, uh, but I wanted to take it to the next step, not only roast or grill the meat, uh, but I wanted to um, create a Moroccan spice rub for you, uh, which will quite frankly work on any protein or any vegetable. Um, so uh, the reasoning behind that is um, the spices that went into this Moroccan uh, spice rub um, definitely parlay themselves into the fall season. Um, so. Uh, many of the flavors or the spices, um, many people or all people um, affiliate these with this particular time of year, such as clove, allspice, cinnamon, brown sugar, uh, a little bit of nutmeg. Um, so once you make this rub, again, very simple to make, um, you're going to make it into a paste, um, then choose your protein. In this particular example, um, I chose to use skirt steak. Um, which is a great cut of meat for grilling, and we're going to do fajitas. So um, I, prepare, I prepared a, a Moroccan spiced rub, skirt steak, fajitas, of course, lettuce. I've got a mango pico de gallo with fresh basil, Monterey Jack cheese, tortillas. I'm just going to go ahead and help myself because I can't contain myself anymore from the wonderful smell. So again, this spiced rub is going to work on vegetables, you use it on scallops, shrimp, beef, chicken, lamb. So would you use that to season before cooking? Uh, definitely before. Uh, so with your meats or your seafoods, um, I, would, I would prefer to marinate those even as much as overnight uh, with your vegetables. Um, they can just go right on the grill as you're brushing the spice rub on. And I'm telling you, it's fantastic with this beer, so. So just check the... And below there will be uh, the recipe and uh, as always, thank you Chef Nico. Can't wait to try one of those too. My pleasure, I got you right here brother. <laughs>